news. And today we have Kim Longbottom from Pathway Australia with Henry's Dry Wine. And she is going to show us lots of her different wines that she's brought with us today. So thank you for joining us, Kim. Thank you. It's a pleasure to be here. Well, great. So first we're going to have her show us her 2008 Pillar Box Red wine. So can you tell me a little bit about this one, the whole story behind it? Okay, so um, Henry's Drive, it's named after the proprietor of the mail coach. She used to drive through our property in the late 1800s. Um, the routes were called Drive, so we called it Henry's Drive. So um, from there, we've expanded our um, wine family, I like to call it, uh, to 14 different wines now. But they all have separate branding and they all have their own unique theme and character. Um, and that all is connected back to the postal history in our region. Very cool. So the Pillar Box Red is a blend of Shiraz, Cabernet and Merlot. Um, and a pillar box is a mailbox, so the slot is where you would post your letter. So um, that's the tie to back to the postal theme. Um, so this wine is about um, a really um, solid, everyday drinking blend of wine. So you get a lot of um, upfront Shiraz characters, some really lovely herbaceous Cabernet characters, and then you also get the Merlot that kind of rounds out the mid palette. But um, yeah, like I said, it's a really solid blend um, and a good everyday offer. Very nice. Now, with what kind of food would you pair this with, or is this just more a sitting down single wine without any food paired with it? No, I think it's always good to have food with wine. Um, and for this, I would go with red meats, um, probably more so lamb. It's a great pizza wine also, oh. or a sausage on the barbecue, um, you know, more of a gourmet style sausage. Um, or, it, you know, it's great with cheese as well, as all of my red wines are. Very nice. Well, would we like to open it up and taste a little bit of this today? Absolutely. Thank you. Mmm, that smells lovely. Yeah, it's lovely earthy aromatics and it has some really um, gorgeous dark berry fruits on the palate as well, a little bit of spice, and some lovely um, integrated oak. Yeah. Mmm. It's good. That is, that is very good. So you can imagine, um, you know, barbecue lamb or a, a nice grilled steak. I'm kind of imagining the pizza myself. Yeah, that sounds really good. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, this is this is very lovely. This is it's a very nice, full, enriching bread. I love the fruity flavors to it. It's, mm. it's very dynamic. Yeah, it's nicely balanced too. I think that makes a big difference. Great. Well, thank you again, Kim, for showing us your pillow box bread today. You're welcome. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers. Mm -hmm.